so we'll keep that there. Uh, let's go to the town hall. So a quick visit to the town hall and see what we've got. What could we trade with? What have we got loads of? Well, we've certainly got a few reeds. My God, 5,000 reeds. Good grief. You know what we really need? We need chickens. We need chickens, guys. Because we've got millions of reeds, but I don't think we've got millions of feathers. Where's feathers? We've got, we've got a fair amount of leather now. We could actually switch to producing uh, leather clothes. I think we've... Yeah, look, feathers. We've got no feathers. That's the problem. We need feathers. Now, for feathers, we need chickens. That's going to be the best source. But for now, I think... I think we've got tons of furnace fuel. My God. What does furnace fuel sell for? It's a good point. What does what does furnace fuel trade for? Let's um let's bang in. I think some furnace fuel. We'll sell some furnace fuel. So furnace fuel. What do you think? We had loads, didn't we? Let's uh, I don't know, like three hundred. Yeah, let's do that. Let's bang in some furnace fuel. Now, what does furnace fuel trade for? Furnace fuel. What it only trades for three. Okay, well that kind of sucks that's nowhere near as good as i thought it was going to be so that's only that's only adding like a like a thousand which is that's nowhere near good enough well what else what the hell else can we like sell what else have we got loads of let's um let's change our tailor to producing uh hide coats because we've got like a ton of leather so he'll he'll be happy for a while what the hell else can we get what, what, what have we got lots of um, not iron, herbs, firewood, no, bricks, near, nah. uh, furniture. I mean, furniture's a possibility, because we're producing a fair old amount of furniture. We could, uh, we could probably get rid of some of that. I don't know what furniture sells for. I've got a sneaking sus suspicion that furniture might actually sell for a fairly decent amount. Let's, um, let's put some furniture in here. What do we want, like... Let's let's say like a couple of hundred furniture. So we've got a bit of an excess. And then we'll see. What does it trade for? So furniture trades for... Furniture trades for 22. My God. Okay, I can see why that's popular for, for trading with. All right, well, we'll do that then. That'll... Uh, I mean, 200... Well, I mean, you're talking about over, uh, uh, over 4,000. Um, so, yeah, cool. Right, well, we'll let that happen. So we'll just minimise that. Good. All right. Sweet. How are we doing with the food? The food is not doing what it should be doing. These guys produce 2,500 food. And yet, we're still struggling. Why on earth would that be the case? How are these guys doing? Yeah, these guys are doing fine. Hmm. Why should we... Well, now we're starting to come up now. Yeah, I think it's just that thing about, like... Just a... Bu yeah, look, we're now we're racing. Yeah, I think it's just, like, a bunch of, a bunch of houses needed to uh, restock. And it takes a while for that to feed through. Yeah, but we are. I think we're producing enough food. It, we just need to give it a bit of time. But having said that, I wouldn't mind getting ahead of the curve. What are we doing in terms of, uh, like, what are our beekeepers doing and stuff like that? Um, how many beekeepers? Yeah, we've got two of two in those, so that's cool. Uh, I really do need to get the wine going. Now, horses, are you, are you starting to actually produce anything yet? Not yet. Not yet. They're up to four of ten. So they are reproducing, though. We're up to four. How about our sheep? How are our sheep doing? Where, where the hell are our sheep? Oh, the sheep are on the other side of the water. Let's go and see what they're doing. Um, now we've got one more. Oh, look, that's a baby sheep. Look. Oh, look at that little baby sheep. It's called a lamb, not a baby sheep, you idiot. Why are you so excited by a lamb? Because they're cute. Look at this water cuddly. You can pick him up in one hand. Uh, no, you couldn't. Right. Next. 
Uh, actually, look, see, that, that, this bit isn't flat here. That needs to be flattened. I'm going to power flatten this. I'm bored with waiting for the flattening. So let's just... Boom, flatten that. And... That. Boom. Right, I think that's actually got this area flattened now. There we go. Cool. So, let's get rid of that. And that. Good. Alright. Now we've just got to wait for them to uh, to finish clearing this. Now this area, still they still haven't finished clearing this. God, bunch of slackers. Get a move on, for heaven's sake. I've only asked you to clear, like, ten tons of lumber and stone and millions of plants and stuff. It's not a big ask. <laughs> I am so demanding. Oh, my throat is starting to give up, guys. Right, how are we doing? How are we doing? Well, the food still is kind of hovering. It's not, like, massively coming up. Um, we're okay on tools. Clothes, yeah, it'll take a while for the clothes to catch up because um, people haven't had clothes for a while, so I'm sure there's a lot of people that need clothes, so that's going to take a while. Uh, we're okay on iron. I don't know how we're doing with iron ore. Is our guy producing yet? Nope, because I bet he's got no iron ore. We're going to have to do some mining fairly soon, guys, I think. I really think we're going to need to do some mining. What? Well, are there any iron ore lying around? Uh, some iron ore up here. Let's just um, let's just tell them. Collect the iron ore from there. Is there any iron ore down here? I don't think there is. No. What about up here? Nope. Any any other iron ore that's like reasonably close? There's a bit here. There's only a little bit though. And oh, there's some here. We'll grab that as well. Okay. But that's that's not going to get grabbed anytime soon. Because um, because there's so much other stuff for the labourers to do. Which is why I'm going to prioritise it. So, yeah. Increase the priority. So, come and grab that bit first. There we go. So, hopefully we'll see some of our uh, labourers wandering up here and grabbing that iron. So, we'll keep iron coming in. I think that's fairly important. But we're we're kind of okay for tools and stuff. Uh, I would like these areas to get flattened, but it's not going to happen anytime soon, so... I should just move on and stop worrying about it. Right, what else are we going to do in our little lake town? I think it's time that we started putting in some other buildings and developing this a little bit. So... Uh, no, that's not what I want. I want this... So let's have a look at other what other buildings. Now we could put a water shrine in. But look, the thing is, look how happy our people are. Our people are crazy happy already. So like what like why would I bother like putting a water shrine in yet? But I don't know. I I think it's so cool though, having a like a church like out in the middle of the water. It would be very cool. Oh, and you, oh, I see now I've got a little bit of an idea. I'm thinking, ah, uh, God, I hate it when I get ideas. Right, you know what? Okay, what I'm going to do, I'm going to extend this um, this dock out here a little bit more. So there, there, and there, there. Then, where's the extent of that? So that's out to there. Then we're going to flip this around. And there, and there, there, and there. And I, I'm going to do a square. I'm going to do a square. I, I always had a feeling that I was going to end up doing a square. But I wasn't 100% sure, but I kind of had the feeling that I was going to do it. There, and there, and there, and there. And then they should just be enough room to slot these in if I've got them in the right place but of course I haven't got them in the right place have I hmm but that's not the end of the world because we can take one of like we could take one of these flip it around if we wanted to 
and put it in there. Now, is that the right place? Yeah, that would be the right place. So I could put that in there. And that solved that little problem. Right, what I was thinking of doing was having... Now let's see. Uh, if I put in... I, should, I probably should put the other buildings in first, but I'm not going to, because I, I kind of want this to be a bit ragtag and not organised. Um, and I'm going to put in... If I can find where I was doing it there. And I'm going to put in a little two there. Oh, am, no, am I going to do that? Am I going to do that? No, I'm not going to do that, actually. I'm going to take those out. Yeah, to take those out. I didn't want to do that. Uh, so let's take those two out. Because I, 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 what I want is to put the church in the centre on its own as a bit of a kind of a centrepiece. So what I was thinking of doing was having the church like surrounded by uh, a bit of a boardwalk and do it like that. That's what I was that's what I was thinking. We'll see what it looks like. We'll, we'll throw it in and we'll see what it looks like. So uh, where's the church? There's the, the church, the water shrine. Um, so we want it kind of sort of there, but I'm thinking that it might be better if it was placed that way like that I don't know it kind of looks better I mean it kind of looks better that way but I must admit I'm kind of in two minds well I've just plonked it down so that's where it's going I think I'm going to wait for that to get built and then put the the stuff around it okay so We've got the, the shrine going in there. Once the shrine is in, then I'm going to start worrying about the other buildings. And I think we're going to do it like the, go the whole hog. We're going to have a school and, like, where else is there? We're going to have a school and a market. And now that's the small dot market. The dot market, the, the, the radius on this thing is huge. Look, look at the radius on this. This is the dot market. It's absolutely enormous. I'm, I'm thinking, I think in the dot market is probably going to go somewhere like there. Like there. And then it covers like all of the dock buildings. And half the blooming town as well. Maybe there. What do you think? Can you put it there? Let's put it there. I got the hell. Right, boom. Dot market in. I, I could have put a small one in. Which is, um, that's the dock home. That's the, this is the small dot market. But I wanted a large one. So, so I put in a large one. So it is what it is. If you don't like it, well, it's kind of tough. Right. Now, am I going to extend this any further? I, uh, I don't know. Not, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. And I, like, I do want to do like a whole Lake Town thing here as well. But I don't know whether I'm going to kind of connect it up, like, through here or not. It might look a bit messy if I do that. But I'm, yeah, it could happen. It could happen. Now, what do they need to build this flaming water shrine? Uh, it's cleared. They just need some more logs, which they are bringing. So a few more logs, and then that'll get built. That's awesome. We're going to need a priest for that. So, where's... Is it under priest? It's not priest, is it? What is it? It's not, it's not like... I can't remember what the what they're called. I'll find out when this gets built. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. My throat is so bad. Here we go. 50% built. Shouldn't take too long. Now, I, like I said, I'm going to put... Um, a whole like a thing going round the outside of this. Yes, a thing. Uh, but actually, I could put the thing in now, can't I? So, like, yeah. right, that would work. So if I do that and that, and do the same on this side, like there and there. Oh, and it's done. Uh, those and three. Yeah, and that needs to go there. And this one needs to go there. 
there we go now we're done and what i'm going to do you, you see how this is kind of going up that side it's kind of lopsided i'm going to do the same thing on this side so this is going to go uh let's see how am i going to do this i'm going to do it like there so we'll do it there and there and then and that is exactly where i want it and then we'll flip that around and put that there cool Oh, I'm liking this. I'm liking this, guys. And we could actually connect these up if we wanted to. Or, or put a, a row going up here or something. This is just very, very cool. I love this. So what is what is the guy that works here? Oh, it doesn't tell you. But we'll put one in. I can't, what the hell is he called? I can't remember what he's called. I thought he was up the top end, though. But apparently not. Got to look for the icon up here but yeah cleric yeah cleric there you go so we've got a cleric now oh and instantly it's got 60 members it's instantly full but like our happiness is already like so high food is still like not awesome which is kind of surprising i have to say all right now there are some other really cool buildings that we can add to here uh now dot market we need some people working here now there are four people allocated to the i think we've got two markets already so we should bump that up by probably another two and so we've got you know what if we set this to two and then we've got now where's the market over here there's a this is the market isn't it Let's set that to two as well. And then we'll set this one down here also to two. There we go. Let's see if people are actually working here now. Yep, yep, we've got two people working there. So it'll be interesting to see how quickly that starts getting supplied with goods. Alrighty. So the people who live in these houses and these houses can now go to this market good right we should do probably another fishery thing over here but there is like i said there are some other cool buildings that i want to start playing around with so what else is there now there's the herb grower and a herb grower that would be a really good idea to to grow like a bunch of herbs but i i am kind of tempted to have like a little mini dock thing going on like near the traders um and yeah ah okay i tell you what we're gonna do i tell you what we're gonna do